Hello everyone, it's Kelsey here. Welcome and welcome back to my channel, Budget Better Life, where I budget, cash stuff, and save for a less stressful, more enjoyable life. If that sounds great and you can relate, thank you for watching. Alrighty everyone, so today we are doing savings challenges towards my goal of saving $10,000. I have Budget with Ira's 6K savings challenge and his 4K mega dice binder here. So this is the money that I unstuffed in my previous video from all of my binders and all of my savings challenges up until this point. And I'm really excited to get all of this money into here so that it can go towards, yeah, saving $10,000. I did not happen to batch film, so I forgot how much money this was because it was a few days ago. So I'm gonna count it all up for you again. Let's count it up and we'll get it into the tray. Oh, should I grab a, mm, I feel like it's a lot of money. So like maybe I should just have a little something something on hand here, a little calculator. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six. So I've got $600 in ones. And then I've got 51, 52, 50, $300 in fifties. I've got 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 80, 500 dollars in 20s. I've got 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 20, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 3, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. So I've got 360 in 10s. So let's put these 10s in here. And then for fives, I have, I've got 5, 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 85, 95, 100. 5, 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 85, 95, 200. 5, 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 85, 95, 300. And 5, 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 85, 90. So 390, I believe. And we'll put these fives in the tray and then let's get ready to count up these ones. So for ones, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. That makes 30. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 40. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 50. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 60. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 70. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 80. And one, two, three, four. So $84 in one. So I gotta add 84 equals. Hopefully I remember to add my fives, but I think I did because I recognize this number. $2,234 is how much money we are cash stuffing today towards the 6K and 4K challenges. So let's go ahead and just separate out these ones just so it fills up the tray a little bit nicer. And then I did go ahead and find the actual correct dice for the, the sorry, this challenge. Um, so these are the dice for the mega dice bundle. And I had a hard time last time because I was using different dice. These will help because the color of the die is the color of the envelope I should be using. So I think what I should do is just like roll the entire dish and just like give it a go. And then we will mark off on here and we'll mark off on here. Steep right off the bat. I see 80 on the percentile die. Um, but let's start with these. So I've got a six and a four, which is 10 and then four and four that makes 18, 19, 20. So a nice even $20 is going to go towards this 6k challenge. Now I grabbed out pink because I figured if I marked it off in pink this time, it will help me to know which ones are the new ones to mark on my poster because I do have this in a poster size. So one six there, and then I need to mark three fours. So one, two, 
three. Oh my gosh, I almost did four. No, three fours. One, two, three. Okay, and then two ones. One, two. Okay, I did that right. That's my $20 for that envelope. Let's go ahead and get this opened. Take my 20. All right, and then if I go to the back, the very back, let's put that there. There's my 6K. So I'm going to put the 20 in front of the 6K. Let's go. Yellow is the percentile. So that one rolled an 80. So let's go ahead and mark off an 80 right there. Flip to the front and we're going to go 50, 70, 80. That takes care of that one. This next one is, see, these two are like the same color. So what is this? This one? Yeah, it's not the 20 sided. No, it is the 20 sided. That goes up to 20. Okay, so I get a 17 on the 20 sided die. So there's a 17 right there. So let me flip forward and we're going to go 10. We're going to go 15, 16, 17. Okay, and then this looks like orange. So I got a 2 on the orange. So we're going to go 2 there flip forward and I've got one and two and then this one's purplish so it's this one and I got a six on here so let me make sure I do a six because I'm looking upside down perfect six on this one so we'll go five six all right this next one is blue and that is this die right here which I just moved but it was a one <laughs> so we're gonna go one right here we're going to do flip forward and we're going to put our one and then the six sided die. We got a one as well. So I'm going to cross off my one flip forward and we will put a one. And finally, on the four sided die, we rolled a three. So right there for three, let's flip it forward and put one, two, three dollars. OK, so I believe I did all of that correct. And I think what I want to do is just go ahead and do it all over again where we roll them all and I'll work my way forward on the envelope. So let's do that. All right, here we go. It's so fun to have all these dice in my hands. Okay, that one already fell, so I just left it. All right, so let's start with the, oh my gosh, I hope I didn't move that one. This one right here is a three again. So one, two, three on that one. Let's flip it forward and make sure I got the right envelope. Yeah, I did. All right, so three there, okay, and then that one's done. I'll put it in the dish. And then this one is, I believe it's the six-sided. Yes, it is. So I got a three on the six-sided as well. So let's go one, two, three right there. Flip it forward and let's mark the three. Perfect. And then this one's blue, so this one's an eight. So I got five, six, seven, eight. Perfect. Flip it forward and let's mark an eight. And then purple, which is this one, I believe is getting five, six. So six on that, flip it, and we're gonna do a six right there. That's a six. All right, and then this one is orange, which I got an 11. So let's go 10, 11 right there. And then we'll flip it. And we'll mark off 11. Perfect. Pink, I got a three. So we're gonna go one, two, three on that one. Flip it forward and mark a three. Do I have another three? Yes, down here. Okay. And then yellow is zero, zero. Now, what does zero, zero mean? I think someone told me that the zero, zero actually means 100. I, I don't know. I, I can't tell because it's in front of the 10. So you'd think it would be 0, 0, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. But if I added all these up, I have to know if this is 100 or if this is 0. I have to know. I have to add them. Okay, so without them being 100, I got 2,360. 2,360. Okay, so the total envelope equals 2,360 so long as the zeros are zeros. So the zeros are not 100. They are truly zero. Okay, so I'm not saving anything for that. If I want my math to all come out and I actually come out to the 2,360. Okay, perfect. Glad I figured that out. 
Um, and then let's add up these. So I've got four, I've got a five as my biggest, and then I've got fours. Man, the fours are like popular, okay? So I have another 20, that's crazy, okay? So yeah, another 20. All right, $20 in, and then let's mark off one five. Where's my fives? I guess I'm gonna stick right around here. So one five, one, two, three fours again. So one, two, three fours, and then a two and a one. Perfect. Okay, so I got all those marked. Did I put my 20? Yes, I did. I got two 20s down, so two rolls worth. Okay, I mean, now we have to just keep rolling, right? Like, there's so much more money still in the tray. We've gone two rounds. All right, let's do it again and shake it up. Okay, okay, this one is a five. He kind of fell off the table. He was rolling at me. All right, let's start with the 6K. So I have a five, 10, 15, 18, 22. Okay, so finally something more than a 20. So I got 22 this time. So I put 21, two, and then let's mark it off. So three fives for five, 10, 15, and then a three for 18, 20 with the two, and then another two, another two for 22. Okay, I marked them all. Throwing myself off, they're so small, these tiny little dice squares, but okay. Then, oh my gosh, another zero, get out of here with this zero. All right, zero, already marked all these, so let's put it in the, in the tin. So zero there, I mean, we're, it's going to hit me with another high one. So I'm letting my zeros be zeros. Okay. And then let's put that there. Then I've got the 20 sided. So I got a 13 on this. Wait, that's for that one. The money goes in the front. Jeez, don't confuse yourself, Kelsey. Mark your 13. This is why you guys are here with me. <laughs> All right, 13. And we're going to put the money in the front. So 10, 11, 12. 13. Okay. And then the yellow one, mm, the orange one is seven. So we're going to do seven, seven right here and flip to the front. And we're going to go five, six, seven. And that's all the money for that one. I think maybe on the next one, I'm going to shove the money in just so I can stop being confused. Okay. And then I've got an eight here. So let's do an eight right here and flip to the front and we're gonna do five, six, seven, eight, perfect. And then this one got a two, so let's mark a two. Oops, that was loud. Flip to the front and go one, two, and then this one got a five. We got a whole row done on that one. So five, Flip to the front and we'll put a five. And then this last one got three. One, two, three. Mark your three like that. Flip to the front and this is where the three goes. Okay, perfect. So now we can go ahead and like try to shove some money into the envelopes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, I'm so close to being able to do 10 for that one. All right, let's just roll. Let's grab them individually and roll them individually as I go. So another three. So let's go one, two, three there. And now I can swap it out. Don't forget to mark my three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten dollars plus two. Perfect. So 12 here going into this one so far and I have to mark my three. So let me just shove this down in. We'll flip to the front and we will mark the three. Okay, then the next one um, is this one here. So I need to grab the six-sided die, right? And I'm give this one a roll. And I got a one. Okay, oh wait, mark your one, Kels. One, all right, grab a one here. And let's give this a count. One, two, three, four, five, plus five is 10. So I'm gonna swap this for a 10. And we're gonna put that down in. Perfect. 
And then let's count this next one here. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So let's swap it for a ten. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. A little bit of condensing as I go. And that's for this one. So I need to roll this die. So it's this die right here. So let's give it a roll. All right, and I got a three. So we'll go one, two, three. And mark a three. And then we will shove all this money in here. All right, perfect. Now let's go to the next one and see how much we have. One, um, just kidding, there's a couple fives mixed in here. So let's count these. 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, which is nice and easy to swap out. So let's go ahead and do that. Swap it for a 20 on the purple. And the purple is this one right here. So let's give it a roll. And I got a one. <laughs> it's like I need to get more than just ones and threes if I want to get through this money. Mark a one. Okay, let's shove this money in and see. You know, we might have to change up my method here. Do some multipliers or something. All right, so this is the next one. I got 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, which is nice. We can go ahead and swap this out for a 20. Grab a 20, and this is for orange. So let's grab the orange die. Roll that. A five. All right. Something more than a one or a three. So we'll put a five. Drop the money in, and then we'll mark our five. So a five right there. And let's count this one up and see what we have so far. I've got 10, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33. So let's leave that. Let's leave three. 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So we're going to swap this for a 20. Oh, I've got to get my fives in there for a 20. 33 is what I have so far in this one. So let's drop it in and then let's find the 20 sided die and give it a roll. It's this one right here. Yay, a 20. All right. Wait, where's the money go? I already dropped it in. Okay, a 20. <laughs> and mark off a 20. All right, I'm happy about that. Getting somewhere. 50, 70, 80, right? That was the first roll we did on the percentile die. So let's drop in the $80. And then let's grab the percentile die and let's give it another roll. Come on, 90. 80, all right. Um, so I could, I was gonna say, I could kind of condense, but I'll just do the same thing again. I'll just go 50, 60, 70, 80 for now. So 50, 70, 80, and I've got to mark the 80. So there's my 80 marked off, and then we'll drop the money in again. And let's check out this one. So 2040, $62 so far in the save 6K poster. So let's go ahead and roll all of the 6K dice again and see what we get. Oh, one already hopped out on me. Okay, so I got two sixes. I got a four, hold on, I got a five, I got a three and a one. Okay, so I got 25, so we'll do $25, and we'll mark off one, two sixes, one five, one five, and then one four, one three, and one one, okay? So four, three, one. All right, so I got those all marked. Okay, so now, what are we gonna do? I say, let's do a couple rounds of this and like really get somewhere on it. All right, here we go. Bunch of ones, that's not getting somewhere. <laughs> All right, a, five, a six, a three, and then one, two, three, four. So that's 10, $13. So let's put our 10, 11, 12, 13, and then let's mark a six, a three and four ones. One, two, three, four. Okay, let's go again. All right, so I've got two sixes, 
Uh, there's some other dice. <laughs> Sorry, words escaped me. So, yes, that's 19. So let's do 20 in, a dollar back for 19, and then let's mark them off. So I got two sixes. I got a three, a two, and two ones. One, two. Okay. I say we just keep going a few more rounds on this until maybe this reaches up over a hundred dollars. Okay, let's see what we got this time. Sixes, fives, ones, twos. I got 10, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So 20 dollars there. So we got a six plus two fives for 16. Two makes 18 and two ones makes 20. Okay, so mark those off. Let's go again. All right, six and six is 12. And I've got 23 total. So we'll go 20, one, two, three, and then two sixes, one, four, one, three, and two twos. Perfect. Let's count this up and see if we can condense it for a $100 bill yet. 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. Oh my gosh. Am I a genius or am I just like super lucky? Cause like, I feel like that was luck. 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. Certainly enough, we can exchange it for exactly a $100 bill. All right, so let's drop this in and let's move on to some of these other ones. So let's go ahead and put our 100 back over here in the cash tray since we've exchanged it out. And let's go for this next one. So this is the percentile die. This is the one that like is steep sometimes. So let's go ahead and roll it like a few times and see what we get. Okay, I got a 60. So 50, so I'm gonna put the money up here so that I can like mark on here. Yes, that's what I'm gonna do. 50, $60, and I'm gonna mark my 60. That's a 90, see I'm looking at it upside down. Okay, that's a 60, okay. Well, I can flip it around and then I'm not looking at it upside down. Oh, look at that, and then I can put the money there for now. Okay, so let's keep going on this for a few times. Another 60, so 50, 60 let's go again this is going to eat up some of my money a 10 wait i have to mark oh kelsey 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 marked my 60 got a 10 marked my 10 there we go don't forget to mark roll with your left hand here we go 10 again 10 mark a 10 roll again 20 put a 20 mark a 20 okay roll again zero mark a zero mark a zero Okay, roll again, 40, 20, 40, mark a 40. Okay, roll again, 30, 20, 30, mark a 30. Okay, roll again, 80. Okay, so wait, hold on, 80. I'll just do 100 in, 20 back for 80, mark an 80, 80 right there. Okay, that's pretty good. Let's see how much money we have going in so far. All right. 150, 100. Let's just swap it right out. So that's 200. 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 300. So 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100 for another 100. And we have 310 going in to the percentile dice right now. Okay. Let's shove it in and then do the next one and let's do the 20 sided die for a few rolls so let's go ahead and do the same thing i think i want to keep it like right side up like this okay so 20 sided die here we go three okay not helpful <laughs> one two three i mean eventually we have to mark off the threes but it's like i'm trying to get through it here okay three go again 19 there we go now we're talking 20 in, a dollar back, and mark a 19. All right, let's roll again. 20, yay. 
All right, you you would think I would like not be happy because it's a 20, but like I've never been so happy to roll a 20. But like, do I even have a 20? I don't think I do. I think I already did my two 20s. So I'm gonna have to do two 10s. So a 10 and a 10 for 20. All right, let's roll again. A one, <laughs> we'll put a one, mark a one. All right, let's roll again. A 20, all right, <laughs> we'll put a 20 and this time we'll do a 19 and a one for 20. All right, let's roll again. Ooh, what is that? A 13, it counts. I rolled it, it counts. I'm marking a 13 and I'm doing 10, 11, 12, 13. All right, let's roll again, 10. All right, we'll mark a 10, put a 10. All right, let's roll again. I think I really just like this die. Okay, a two, one, two. All right, let's roll again. A three, okay, with the threes today. I think I'm out of threes. I'm out of threes. A one and a two for three, but did I put the three? No, I don't think I did. One, two, three, okay, there we go. All right, let's roll like two more times maybe. 11, okay, 10. 11 and there's an 11 okay one more time 13 all right so let's find a 13 if we can i can't find a 13 so i'm going to do 11 and 2 for 13 so 10 11 12 13 okay so that should be all the money going into this one right now so let's take a look it's this one right yeah all right, so let's count it up and see how much we have. I don't know what I'm going to do when I get to the end and I still have like a bunch of ones because I'm condensing as I go. But we'll find out, won't we? All right, so I got 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. So let's just swap it out for a $100 bill right there and then let's count up these ones one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen let's just keep the ones i mean they're gonna have to go into the envelopes at some point so let's just shove all this down in and then go on to this next one this one's pretty easy to read upside down so i'll just leave this one upside down and it's this die right here so let's roll and i got a six so we're gonna go five six and mark a six Roll again. I got uh, another six. So we'll go five, six, and mark a six. Let's roll again. Oops. Um, sure enough, I don't know if you guys can see that or not. It might have rolled off camera, but it's a six. So <laughs> six. Okay, let's roll something other than a six. An 11. All right, perfect. So 10, 11, and we'll mark 11. Let's go again. A 12, that's nice. So 10, 11, 12, and we'll mark a 12. I wanna see if we can make a whole row. Let's go again. Nine, okay, there's a nine, and let's do 10 in a dollar back for nine. Let's roll again, we need an eight, a one, and a 10. Ooh, an eight, okay, eight. So let's go 10 in two back for eight. One, two back for eight, and I marked my eight. Okay, so now I just need a 10 and a 1 to complete a full row. Let's see if I get it. A 7. That's not a 10 or a 1. <laughs> okay, 5, 6, 7. There's a 7. Okay, next. 7? I don't have any more 7s. I really don't have any more 7s. I did all my 7s. I got a good idea. I'm going to do 4 and a 3 for 7. And I got to put my 5, 6, Seven. Now I need a 10 and a one. I think I needed a 10, a four, and a one to make a whole row, and I, I was off. Okay, here we go. A three. No, I don't need a three. <laughs> All right, I think I better give up on this. One, two, three. I'm going to mark a three. All right, that's pretty good. We did a good amount of rolls on that, so I didn't make a full line yet, but we will get there. All right, let's organize this up a little bit and give it a count, see what we have. So I got 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 55, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 75. So why don't we do 50, 60, 70, 
and then we'll leave a five. So this should be 70. 10, 20, 30, 40. 45, 50, 55, 60. 61, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 70. All right, so there we go. And we've got 75 going into this envelope right here. Oops, I just closed it. All right, so the next one is this one here, which is, I think it's this one. Let me just double check. Yeah, it goes up to 10. Okay, so it's this die right here. So let's go ahead and give this a roll. All right, I got an 8. So let's go five, six, seven, eight dollars and mark an eight. All right, again, a seven. So we'll go five, six, seven, mark a seven. Okay, so let's go again. So I got a five. So put a five, mark a five. Let's go again. I got another eight. We'll mark an eight. We'll go five, six, seven, eight. And let's go two more times. So a two right here, let's go one, two, and then let's go again, and another two. Okay, so one, two. So let's give this a count and see what we have going into this one now. All right, we've got five, 10, 15, 20, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 30, one, two. So 32 going into this one. And again, I think I'm just going to keep the ones and the fives and everything because they're going to have to go in here eventually. All right, this next one is this one right here. So let's give this a couple of rolls. So we got a six. So we're going to go five, six. This thing's going to be so full by the end of it. Did I mark my six? I think I did. Four. So four. Let's go one, two, three, four. Okay. A six again, six, so let's go five, six, okay, and an eight. So let's do an eight right here, and let's go a 10 in and then two back for eight. Okay, so now let's give this one a count and see how many, how much rather is going in here. 10, 15, 20, one, two, three, four. 24 going into this one. So let's drop that in. So the next one is this one right here. So let's give it a roll. So I get a two. So let's go one, two. Let's roll again. I get a three. Look at that. Oh, dang. I thought I had a full row. Okay. Uh, so put a five in. Take two back. That's three. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Let's go again. Four, I really wanted a five. Okay, four, one, two, three, four. All right, and I marked my four. Let's go again, let's hope for a five. Four again, one, two, three, four, and mark a four, All right? Let's roll again, come on five, come on five. A one, and a one. Okay, so that's that for that one. So I have, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen dollars going into this one right here. Now, this is the next one. And I kind of am curious to see. Like maybe it will take the fun out of it for me if I'm not able to roll all of the dice every time. But I'm tempted to like max this envelope out and then max this one and then see if I can max this one. You know what I mean? I think I'm gonna go for it. So let's just, I mean, it would be like me rolling this like a million times. <laughs> not really, because there's obviously not a million, but like, I'm going to roll it. Whatever it says, I'm going to do the whole row. Let's do it. Oh, wow. Okay. It went on the floor. It's like, does that even count? You know, because it went on the floor. Let's go again. Here we go. One. I'm going to do all the ones. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 10, 11. All right. I did all the ones. All right. Let's do it again and see what happens. Three. All right. So let's go three, six, nine, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24. All right. So 
Okay, so I'm gonna do 25 in and a dollar back for 24. All right, let's see what happens. If I roll a two or a four, I'm gonna do it. But if I don't, I might move on. Oh my gosh, I rolled a four. Okay, so four and four is eight, and eight and eight is 16, and then four and four is eight, and then eight and eight is 16, so that's 32. So I'm up to 32, so 20, 30, one, two. And then four and four is eight, and then eight and eight is 16. So then 10, 15, 16. Okay, so that's all the fours done. So it's like, I might as well do the twos too. <laughs> I think I'm going to, guys. All right, let's just get this order or get this in order to start and see what we have in here so far. And then, you know what? I might as well just do the twos. Like, let's just do it. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, two, four, 24. So again, let's go 25 and then take a dollar back. Okay, so let's count this up. See how much we're putting in. 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100. 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100. Take the 100 and then five, six, seven. So 107 in here. Now let's pull this and see if it totals 130. Because if it does, I did my math right. And if it doesn't, then, you know, <laughs> I'm not surprised. <laughs> All right, so 110, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Yay, I did my math right. All right, so let's just leave a 10, trade this out, and then we will pull a 20, and I have my $130. And I've got one of these envelopes fully funded. One, 20, 30. Oh my gosh, it's actually kind of really exciting. So I know it's kind of like a weird way to do it, but like... <laughs> I mean, one of them's complete. I want to try to do it with this one too. I mean, I've got a bunch of money left. And imagine if like I did get through this entire 4K binder, then I would just be on to this. Like that would be, yeah. Okay, obviously I'm not going to get through the entire 4K binder today, but like, all right, I'm getting ahead of myself. Here we go. We're rolling here. What I'm going to do this time is I'm going to roll and I'm going to, mark off whatever I get plus it's opposite to make 10. Okay, that probably doesn't make any sense, but you guys will see. Ready? Roll. Okay, so I rolled a two. So I'm going to mark a two and I'm going to mark, oh, I can't mark an eight. Just kidding. I'm going to mark another two and a six. Okay, that makes 10. Okay, let's do it again. Four. So I'm going to make, I'm going to mark a four and then another four and a two to make 10. Perfect, okay, let's go again. Okay, I got a three. So I'm gonna mark a three and then another three for six and then a four to make 10. Okay, let's go again. All right, I got a five, so I'm gonna mark two fives to make 10, okay? I got a two, so I'm gonna do two, um, plus three for five, plus another five for 10. I'm just making stuff up at this point, guys. Here we go. Three, so I got a three and a three for six and then a four for 10, okay? I feel like this would work really good with the 10-sided die, but I went for it with a six-sided die, but we're just going with it now at this point. All right, I got a six, so let's just go six and six for 12. Maybe we could just double them? I'm just doing random things now. Okay, go again. Another two, so let's just go two, four, six, and just like cross off a bunch of them. Okay, let's go again. All right, another two. I think I've done all the twos. Yeah, I have. So instead, we'll go one, two, and then three, four, and then a six for 10. Okay, let's roll again. All right, I got a three, so we've got three, six, and a four for 10. All right, and then let's go again. All right, I don't have, I don't have any more threes. I'm gonna re-roll it. One, so let's do one, two. So let's just do the last two there. And then we're down to fives and sixes. 
All right, we're just gonna we're just gonna do it. We're gonna go six and six for twelve. So let's go ten, eleven, twelve, and then let's go five, ten, fifteen, twenty. Oh my gosh, I have to get it back out again. Oh my gosh, I can't even believe it. I'm just like. I definitely didn't think that I was going to be like completing any of the envelopes, but when I saw the numbers were so low and like I had so much left in the cash tray, it's like, why not? Like, just go for it, right? All right. So this envelope is supposed to save me 178. I'm putting in 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32. So I'm putting in 132. So let's grab all of this together and add it all up and see how much I have in total in this one. Perfect. All right, let's count it all up. 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, 60, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 178. Sure enough. All right, so let's go 50, 100, and then let's go 70, and then we'll keep a nice looking five, and then we'll keep some nice looking ones. Six, seven, it's gotta be another nice looking one in here, eight. Okay, that's what we're keeping. This is going back in the tray because we exchanged it out. In the tray you go. Okay. Perfect. So let's go ahead and add it up one more time and make sure we have our 178. 51, 20, uh, 5. No, 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 no. That's not correct. I need an extra 50. $50 off, Kelsey. How could you do such a thing? Okay. 50, 150, 60, 70, 5, 6, 7, 8. So we have 178. Yes, we do. We have $178. And that one is completed. Okay, let's, I mean, this is an eight-sided die. We could, we could try for it again with this one, or we could try for it with this one and do my 10 method that I was working on on the last one, but it didn't work. So I think I'm going to skip the eight and I'm going to the 10-sided die. So that's this one right here. So let's go for it. Okay, so I got an eight. So I'm going to do an eight and a two for 10. Okay, let's go again. So a five, so I'm gonna do five, 10 for 10. Okay, let's go again. A six, so I'm gonna go six and four for 10. Let's go again. So I'm gonna do eight and two for 10. So now all my eights are done and all my tens or uh, twos are done, but did I put my 10? I don't know, we'll find out. Okay, zero. Does that mean 10? I think that means 10. Okay, 10 for 10, that's easy. Um, two, can't do. Oh, two, how about two for 20? Let's do that. Two tens, put 20 in. <laughs> okay, let's go again. Two for another 20. All right, so I'm gonna put a 10 in, and I'm, wait, am I doing a 10 or am I doing a 20? I'm just gonna do a 10, because I have a 10 in my hand. Okay, we'll do a 20 the next time we roll a two. All right, we rolled a nine, so let's go nine and one for 10, go again, two. Okay, so again, I wanna do $20. So I'm gonna do a 20 in and I'm gonna do two nines and two ones. Okay, let's go again. All right, a 10, well, I, it, I used all the tens. All right, seven and three for 10, one, and nine, all the nines are done. No, not all the nines are done. I have no idea, but I have. I don't know if I put my 10 down either. Okay, another nine. See, I have more nines here, but I can't do the, the counter because, so five, six, seven, eight, nine, because all my ones are gone. So let's just do that. Zero, I don't have. Eights, I don't have. Nine, I do have. So let's do the last nine. So five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, so now I'm down to seven, sixes, fours, threes. Uh, I don't have nines. I don't have eights. I don't have tens. I don't have tens. 
I don't have tens. I have fives. I've got one five. Got one five left. Okay, so now I really don't have any fives. Okay. This dice clearly has a preference. Seven and three for ten. And then let's just keep going. Seven and three for ten. Seven and three for ten. Okay, so now what am I down to? Sixes and fours. So go six and four is ten. Six and four is twenty. So let's do that. And now the last two I have is these two fours. So four and four for eight. So let's go five, six, seven, eight. Now I believe I have every single one marked off. Okay, so let's count it up and see how much we have here. Okay, let's give this a count and see how much we're putting in. Putting in 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 75, 85, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 201. So I'm putting in 201 here. Yes, 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 here. So 201, which means in here I should have 93. And if that's the case, I've done my math right. And if it's not the case, I messed something up at some point. I feel like I did. All right, so we're shooting for 93. 20, 30, 40, 55, 65, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 80, 1, 2, 3. Yeah, I missed a 10 at one point, I think. I forgot to put it. So now that I've put that 10 in, if I add all of this together, I should have the 294. 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200. 10, 20, 35, 45, 55, 65, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94. I think I'm off by a dollar. 94. All right. I'm going to count it up one more time, but I think I should swap some of this out. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So 25, I'm going to take these and I'm going to take a 20 and a 5. Now, now that doesn't make sense because it's supposed to be 94. Kels, what have you been doing? Taking the 5 back, taking $4. <laughs> oh, 1, 2, 3, 4. All right, let's... Let's count all this up and see if this is correct now. 294. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. 20, 40, 60, 81. Yes, that's 100. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 92. That's 200. Now this should be 94. 10, 20, 30, 40, 55, 65, 75, 85, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94. I have done it. We have $294 in this envelope and another one completely fully funded did i do this oh my gosh guys i can't even handle it at this point like it's crazy i definitely wasn't expecting that it might take some of the fun out of rolling this binder but at the same time i'm still gonna have a lot of rolls on the higher ones to do and i still have more money in the tray I mean, I could put more towards the 6K, but again, like how nice would it be to have the 4K binder like said and done? Oh, I don't know. Decisions, decisions. I think what I need to do is, so this one has a lot of spots left. I think I'm just gonna continue on my merry way with rolling all of them except for this one because these ones are done now. So in little Ira's pouch, I'm gonna put the ones that I've completed. So I've completed three. Um, so yeah, that's pretty amazing. Okay, so I'm going to roll all of these and we're gonna keep going in this binder. 
Okay, so I got a three here. So let's go one, two, three. I'm gonna stick it in front. And then this one is this one. I got a seven here. So let's go, am I done with all the sevens? Yeah, I'm done with all the sevens. Let's just re-roll it. All right, 11, so let's do 11. 10, 11. Okay, sorry, okay, I did put my 11. Sorry, there was some noise going on. Apparently someone was making a smoothie. But anyways, that was really, threw me off. Um, so, okay, so I did my 11 on that one. So then this is my 20 sided and I got a 10 on that. So let's put a 10 and let's mark off a 10 on the 20 sided. If I have any 10, see I don't. Let's just mark two fives. Um, and then I got a 20 on the percentile die. So let's put a 20 and let's mark a 20. Okay, perfect. So, and I put a 20, right? Yeah. I still have more money here and it needs to go into these challenges. I'm going to do a couple more rolls on, let's just do this one more time and then we'll hit the percentile hard and then we might go back to the 6K. I don't know. I'm undecided. Okay. A one, a three, a three, like, okay, really? All right, a 70, I can handle. Let's do 70. 70 makes me happy because it's like 20, 40, 60, and 70. Perfect. All right, so let's flip that. Now I got a one on this one, and I don't think I have any more one spots. I don't. So let's just re-roll it and see what I get. Okay, a 12. Let's see if I have a 12. Okay, there's 12. So let's go 10, 11. 12 and I'll put that there and then this one is this one and I got a three here I do have a three left on that so we'll go one two three and let's flip that and do that and then that one's complete and then this one I got a three so I do have a three spot there so I know I said I was gonna go back to one two three so to the percentile die but I think I'm just gonna go for it. And by that, I mean I'm going to complete this one because then I'll have all the front ones done. One, two, it'll be this one, this one, this one. So I'm gonna do it. I'm going to, I guess, just add them all up, right? I mean, I could sit here and roll and roll and roll and do match and match and match, <laughs> or I could just mark them all off, go to the front and put 226 in. And like, guys, that seems a little bit like nicer <laughs> or like easier. So I'm just going to mark off everything on here. First off, I hope I have enough money. I didn't even think of that. Well, we'll see. We'll just, we'll just see, you know, guys, if you don't know me very well, I will tell you that I am someone who is very just like random. Some might say impulsive. Some might say reckless. I'm just living on the edge over here. I'm like, let's just mark them all off and hope I have enough. We'll see what happens. What's the worst that could happen? All right. Oh, missed a seven. Okay, so let's go for it. And they're all checked off. We're going to add up the money that's in here and we're going to make the envelope $226. That's what we're going to do. All right, let's get this in order. Okay. Slightly in order. Here we go. So right now I have 20, 30, 40, 55, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80. All right, so I've got $80 in an envelope that's supposed to have $226. So if we minus out 80, I need $146. So 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 30, 40, 5, 6. Look at that. We had plenty of money. We can just go ahead and mark off all the boxes we want. All right, so let's... You know, this is kind of making me miss my piggy bank where I could just like shove a bunch of money in and then like color a bunch of things. But, you know, slow and steady is nice too. But all right, let's go ahead and give this account. We should have $226. 24, 
20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 95, 200, and 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Okay, perfect. I'm going to leave a dollar and a five. And yeah, and I'm going to try to swap all of this out and see how many tens I can take. 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30. So I'm going to take three tens and that's just going to make my life a little bit easier. So that's what it is. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 2, 10, 25, 26. 226 in this one right here. We have another completed like envelope in this 4K binder. This one's complete. My gosh, guys. It's like, should I just see how much money I have left and see if I can complete this next one? It's like, why not? You know, knock them off in order, right? And then it's kind of like a way, like technically, if you wanted to start with the small envelopes and use them to like fund your higher envelopes, you know, and then you just start again on the low ones. Like you could do something like that, you know? Um, so in the save 222, right now I have 50, 70, 95, 100, and 10, 20, 30, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4. So I have 144, and I'm supposed to have 322, so minus 144 is $178 is how much money I would need to put into that envelope to fully fund it. So, I mean, we might as well just count up some money and see what we have, see if we can get to 178. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 95, 100. 5, 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75... <laughs> 76 77 78 sure enough gosh this is fun though like it's not what I expected but it's fun because like you know how happy you feel when you like complete something and that's the same way it feels when I complete these envelopes it's like it's just fun all right traffic is loud right now hold on all right, let's see here. $322. That's how much I want. 50, 70, 90, 100. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200. 10, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 85, 95, 300. And 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2. So that is correct. I'm going to do 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 for a 5. And that's as condensed as it can be. I'm going to count up one more time really quickly to make sure it's 322. 50, 79, 1, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 92, 10, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 85, 95, 3, 5, 10, 15, 20, 1, 2, 322 dollars going into this envelope right here, getting sealed up. And then I get to cross them all off again. Guys, I honestly have like the biggest grin on my face because I felt like this 4K binder would take a long time. And like now with me having like a few of the envelopes fully funded, it feels a lot easier. So even though I have the high ones left, it's still like a huge accomplishment and it feels really nice. And it's all honestly, It's honestly a little bit more satisfying than the piggy bank because you get to see the actual amount. Like with the piggy bank, you can't see what's in there at all. It's nice to know there's a bunch of money in, but like you can see 322. Like it's really exciting. Okay, so we just keep going here and we put this money in because this money's already been saved for this one. So let's drop this down in and then let's drop this money down in here as well. And let's roll the percentile die on the hopes that, I don't know, should I just roll some of these again? I'm just, I'm worried. 
Let's just count my fives. If I have $90, I'm gonna, I'm gonna roll this at least one time. 5, 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 70, 5, 85, 90. 5, 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 85, 90. I have at least two rolls of the percentile dice that I feel I can do confidently. So let's do that. So let's go ahead and roll this one. 90, look at that. Aren't I glad I made sure I actually had the 90. All right, so we've got 90 to put in. 5, 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 85, 90. There's 90. Let's roll it one more time and see what we get. 90. This is so funny, guys. I was getting low numbers all video, and now I'm getting 90s. 5, 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 85, 90. All right, there's my two shots of 90 and my two 90s marked off. Now that envelope is like crying for help at this point. Like with these fives in here, it's gonna be rough, but I don't think we'll be able to close this binder, but you know, it's all right, it's all right. I've got something in the works soon. So, okay, let's go ahead and finish out with the 6K. And I don't know, I don't really feel like counting the money first, so let's just hope I have enough to roll all the dice. <laughs> and we'll just do that. All right, here we go. Of course, I get like three sixes and a five and a four and a one. All right, so that is ten, twenty-two dollars So yeah, just kidding, $28, because I didn't count that. <laughs> Forgot a six. Okay, so $28. Good thing I checked my math. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28. And now we need to mark off. And I feel like I should kind of start over here. So I'm going to start on this side here. And I'm going to go one, two, three sixes, one, five, one, four, and one, one. Let's roll again and see what we got. I'm gonna re-roll that one. Here we go. I get a six, I get a five, I got two fours, I get a three, and I got a one. All right, so this time I got 23. Five, 10, 15, 20, and then I got one, two, three. So 23. And then we need to mark off a six, a five, two fours, one three, and one one. Okay, let's roll again. Oops, I'm gonna re-roll that one. All right, so I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go until there's no money. And if I roll more than what there is, I'm just gonna like take a dice away or something like that. Um, just so I use it all up, but I don't like go over because I don't know. There's no IOUs in my world anymore. I need to add my dice. Okay, 24. So let's go 5, 10, 15, 20, and then 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay. And let's mark off two sixes, one five, one four, one two, and one one. Okay, perfect. All right, I'm gonna roll again. All right, I got a bunch of fours. I got one six, I got a two, and I got a one. All right, so 21. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Is that crazy? I just grabbed the exact amount I needed. All right, let's mark a six. Let's mark three fours. One, two, three fours, a two, and a one. Perfect. Okay, let's count up how much I have. Uh, let's not. Let's just roll. Let's just roll. Here we go. All right, so a bunch of low numbers this time. So I got a five, I got a four, I got a two, and I got three ones. So $14. 4, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Wouldn't it be amazing if we went to like exactly what we had? All right, so 14 going in, and then let's mark off a five, one, four, and a two, and then one, two, three, ones. Okay, so I have one, two, three, four, five, six, 
one, two, three, four, five. So why don't we just roll two dice and see what happens? A four and a one. So let's mark a four and a one for five. One, two, three, four, five. And now I have six dollars left. So should I just roll one die and see what happens? A one. Okay, that's not helpful. Oh, it's like, do I put it or do I just mark a six? Because I have six. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six. We're doing it. We're marking a six because I have six, even though I rolled a one. And that is it, guys. All of that money, all this money that I pulled from my binders, from my hardworking savings challenges, got pulled to go towards our goal of ten thousand dollars we're trying to save up another ten thousand dollars as fast as we can because we are really trying to buy a house this year we are in the market for a house and it's seeming to be like a lot more it just seems like it's coming up like a lot sooner it's all feeling quite real um yeah, so we want to be as prepared as we can, which is why I wanted to get all of this money towards my 6K and 4K binder. I mean, look at this thing. Is this just like, hold on. First off, there's that. Okay, so that's not helping. And then that sucker is like maxed out. Like, I can't even. Oh, it's so exciting though. Alrighty, guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. I had a blast. It was so much fun. I need to go and record these on my actual poster. I will try to get a video of that, but it was an epic fail last time. If I can get a video of that, I will put it in now. Okay, so it's the next day, and rather than try to do this on the wall, I pulled the poster down. So I'm gonna do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine sixes over here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. And then I did one, two, three, four, five, six, seven fives. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That looks right so far. And then I did one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine fours. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then I did one, two, three, four, five threes. One, two, three, four, five. And then I did one, two, three, four, five, six, seven twos. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven twos. And a whole lot of ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, okay. And then on this row, I did one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight sixes. So one, ooh, I don't wanna like smudge it. Ooh. Two, oh, how many was it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, fives. One, two, three, four. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, fours. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, fours. One, three, so one, three, three twos, one, two, three, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight ones. One, two, 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And there it is all marked off on the poster, matches what's marked off on the paper. And that's it guys. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed. I hope you subscribe um, and watch me try to reach this goal of saving $10,000. And other than that, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.